what is the actual issue with like modern shoes that people really, they don't even think about? Mm. So it's, it's a couple of different things. I, I like to focus on four main ones. So the app, the biggest problem, according to me, is the the shape of the toe box. This is the toe box is where your toes are in the in the shoe. So if you look at a perfect uh, the perfect anatomy of a foot, um, and if you look at one from for um, a newborn baby, for example, their foot is actually the widest at the toes, and this is something that we don't really see any shoes are shaped after. And instead, when 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 you go buy like a shoe that says that, that it is wide, it'll be wide, but it'll be wide at the middle part of the of the foot, and then the toe box will still be pointy. So put, placing your your big toe and your fifth toe out of position, like towards each other, and um, and that's not really how the foot is supposed to look. It's not how the foot is supposed to move. So, and, and the thing is, like when you when you do put the, the big toe out of position you will actually have a lot of consequences up in the chain of the body so you can actually try this i mean um if you if you're listening to this and you, you stand up and you you put your your toe in a correct position which would be a straight line from from the metatarsal the bone um and then you actually just with your finger put the, um, the toe towards the other toe like a lot you will see that the arch starts to collapse and what happens when the arch collapses? Well, the, the knee starts caving in, right? And then that will have consequences up to the hip and the lower back. So just that one thing of having a, a pointy toe box will actually might give you, you know, lower back pain two years later or three years later. And you don't, and you're like, oh, why, why do I have a lower back pain now? So that's one aspect of, of why shoes are, are, pro are problematic. And then we have, you know, um, the sole uh the sole stiffness a lot of soles are very very stiff and this is honestly I, I still have a hard time understanding why people do this um but they're so not bendy so which means that your your toes cannot bend like they're supposed to uh and that's that's horrible for for the walking gait cycle so you you're literally putting your your toes to sleep uh when you're walking which is which is not good and um and then we have you know the drop so the meaning that your your heel is higher than the forefoot and uh when, what happens there is that you're 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 quite literally standing downhill right? and putting a lot of pressure on on the forefoot and what happens if you're standing downhill it, it's quite, quite obvious that the body has to to compensate and the body will have to make itself straight again meaning that you'll have start several comp um what is it called? Um, uh, compensations in the body uh, to make up for that structural uh, problem at, at the feet. And what they also do when they when they put that heel to toe drop is they'll put something that we call a toe spring in the in the footwear industry, where uh, you probably see this in shoes, but that uh, they kind of angled upwards again at the toes. And this is for that because they want to give you this sensation that you're rolling forward. That you kind of, kind of like walking on clouds, right? Um, but what happens then is that you're you're actually stretching the the fascia under the foot, which which means that there it's it's in a complete stretch position all day, uh, or for as, as long as you you're wearing the shoes, meaning that that puts a lot of pressure again, and your foot will never be able to relax. So you can sometimes see that when people take their shoes off and their their foot is still in that position, and it's like okay, yeah you've been wearing these uh, these kinds of shoes for many years uh but yeah the, the, those are those are really the the main issues and uh it's quite a lot but again then we we do we try to do all those things kind of the, the opposite right to to fix that